Well, tonight here at Pontiac, we're holding our um, first ever Maker Fair. Um, we've invited students to give presentations on things that they've made. And then we also have a number of rooms where people are presenting projects um, so that students can get to touch things hands-on and see some of the, the cool t um, tools that um, a lot of makers use. Um, in one room, we have an area where kids are doing um, coding and they're taking part in a program called um, the Hour of Code tonight. In another room, um, kids are working with something called Little Bits so they can practice um, using little magnetic electronic bits to prototype with. We have something called Three Doodlers so kids can practice um, drawing in three dimensions. We have another room with just Legos so kids can practice building with Legos. Basically, the idea is to come today to school um, at night and get an opportunity to um, tinker and play around and, and basically just explore all the different ways you can make stuff. It's hard to say exactly how this idea came about. Um, I guess myself and Marissa Young, another teacher at this school, we got to the opportunity to go to a national convention, um, ISTE. And at the convention, we saw a lot of schools and a lot of districts doing things with what's called the maker movement. And we got real excited by it. And we talked for a while on the trip and think, thought about, you know, how are ways that we could do this at our school? And we decided, you know what, let's just have a fun night for everybody at once so that we can get the whole school to explore the idea of making things at one time. Well, I hope that they learn a little bit about creativity, a little bit about um, inventions. Um, I hope they get excited about careers with technology, but it doesn't have to be technology. I just like, for me, it's the idea of making things. It's a direct connection between school and maybe something later on in their life. A lot of kids here um, with their projects, they're just presenting things that they like to do around the house, so it's an opportunity for them to bring the community to school tonight. Um, and we also have some professions here that kids can explore. We have some robots in the background that are whizzing around. So I guess basically is we just want kids to take, some, take home some excitement about making things.